Hello everyone and welcome to this video where I will be showing three teams that will aim to clear all the missions. Obviously there's some missions where you have to just clear the mission 15 times. Um, the last team in this video should help with speeding that up because you do have to, you only really have to clear the hardest difficulty 15 times since um, the first set of missions is any difficulty, but the second set of missions is the hardest difficulty only. But by doing the hardest difficulty, you can clear both missions at once. Um, this first team is just a really fast team for the lower difficulty missions, because there are three missions for the lower difficulty only that basically have you where you have to clear with Vivi and Rebecca, and obviously Vivi and Rebecca will fulfill that condition. This really is just a support showcase, basically. The supports get rid of most of the debuffs. Shirohoshi Mancherry gets rid of the hunger on stage 3, as well as getting rid of the silence on this stage, which is the last stage. So essentially, Whitebeard is just an attack down reducer. Nami is a block or produce flock orb manipulator, as well as just general damage boost. And Shirohoshi Mancherry gets rid of hunger as well as one turn of silence, which you could probably stall. And Vivi and Rebecca are just here because they're Vivi and Rebecca. Moving on, here is the team that most of you are here for, which is how to clear the 10 star difficulty. And this is actually a free to play team. <laughs> I didn't mean for it to be a free to play team, but it just ended up being a free to play team. Um, there is a bug right now where you can use Versus Legends. I don't think they will fix it. Bandai does not seem like the company to care, <laughs> to be honest. Um, I don't think you need the versus ability because in the second clip I use a weaker captain as and I do manage to clear without the versus ability however on this team I do have an extra dud unit which is Rebecca and Viola which is just here for chopper man uh, but yeah free to play team uh, Viva and Rebecca don't hit very hard on this team, obviously, because versus Kanu and King will not boost them. You could try using Kazuna Kaido or Treasure Map. Uh, Queen, was it? Yeah, Queen. Because they're also decent free to play captains. Um, I personally am using the. Kazuna Kaido one because he gives cooldown in his captain, which is what I'll be showing in the second faster team. It's only about a minute faster, but a minute times 15 is 15 minutes. So. Well, I guess I do do. No, this was necessary stalling for ores. There aren't many driven powerhouse quick units that get rid of attack down and when they do they only get rid of three turns i'm thinking of moria right now but this orz gets rid of exactly four turns but he really doesn't do much else he's just here as a beat stick otherwise zoro very nice for charging the versus ability however you don't need the versus ability at least not when you take out rebecca and viola the speed on the second team is just there to reduce cooldowns by basically one turn, so maybe not worth it, you could run someone else. If you want to be safer, I believe Treasure Mac Queen has a higher multiplier for attack, but I believe he also has less damage reduction because I never use King's special in this. 
do not use King Special here on the last stage because they will interrupt you, they'll clear all buffs and do the slot bind thing. You also probably do not need the ship. I'm just using it for the extra HP. And before because you can use a VV special on stage 3, I don't remember if I did it in this clip. But to be safe, you can run this ship, eat a meat orb on stage 3 using the ship special, and then just double VV special on the previous stage. Sorrow can probably be replaced with a better affinity booster that affects both Driven and Powerhouse, because Ores right now is not getting an affinity boost. Here is just a faster team I was talking about. Um, Vivi is still on this team because she's a decent hunger remover, as well as just giving nice attack boost. It doesn't matter that she does no damage herself, she's just got a pretty nice special. Um, as I said earlier, speed is just here to reduce cooldowns even more. Kaido's captain ability, though he has a lower multiplier than other free-to-play quick captains, he does reduce cooldowns by 2, which is what he's on the team for. Here I'm stalling for uh, orbs to charge up versus kind of special, even though I... I mean versus ability, even though I never end up using it, so you could shave a few extra... a few extra seconds if you don't do the random stuff I was doing. So yeah, on average this team should be clearing in under 3 minutes. House of pause here. So. I was just deciding whether or not to pop VV special early because I was... Yeah, I stalled an extra turn here too. I didn't need a stall turn because I never ended up charging a Kainu. Yeah, you can definitely get this done under 3 minutes. There's probably gonna be some other optimal teams that can get this done, like, even quicker, but for now, this is the best I've got. If you've gotten this far into the video, thank you for, the, for watching. Um, videos for World Journey 3 and 4 should be up soon, if not by tomorrow.